Yinotheria is a proposed basal mammalian subclass clade that contains a few fossils of the Mesozoic and the extant monotremes. These animals could have been more widespread and diverse in Gondwana during that time. Like other mammals, monotremes are endothermic with a high metabolic and produce milk through mammary glands to feed their young. But the key anatomical difference between monotremes and other mammals gives them their name. Monotreme means single opening in Greek, referring to the single duct, the cloaca, for their urinary, defecatory, and reproductive systems. Modern monotremes are the survivors of an early branching of the mammal tree, and a later branching is thought to have led to the marsupial and placental groups. Molecular clock and fossil dating suggest platypuses split from echidnas around 19 to 48 million years ago. The common ancestor was aquatic, but echidnas adapted to life on land. To date, Synodolphus is the oldest metatherian fossil known, estimated to be 125 million years old. Metatherians differ from all other mammals in certain morphologies like their dental formula. Boaena was a predator, it had a large head and a powerful neck similar to living hyenas. Its legs were cursorial, albeit less specialized than those of the marsupial thylacine. Jumping on its hind legs, Argyrolagus resembled a gerbil. It had a long tail for balance and a narrow head with a pointed snout. It was probably nocturnal. An interesting fact about Thylacosmolus is that its canine teeth grew throughout its life. Some scientists have speculated that maybe this marsupial may have had to chew on hard surfaces to keep its teeth from growing too long. Marsupials give birth to relatively undeveloped young that often reside in a pouch located on their mother's abdomen for a certain amount of time. Close to 70% of the 334 extant species occur on the Australian continent. The Virginia opossum is noted for reacting to threats by feigning death. This is the genesis of the term playing possum, which means pretending to be dead or injured with intent to deceive. It has been found to be very resistant to snake venom. The common spotted cuscus is typically very shy and solitary creature, feeding and nesting alone. Interactions with others, especially between competing males, can be aggressive and confrontational. It is hunted for its meat and pelt in New Guinea, but has very little economical influence. This form of the common brushtail Perseum is the Australian marsupial most often seen by city dwellers, as it is one of few that thrives in cities, as well as a wide range of natural and human mo The sugar glider is one of a number of volplane possums in Australia. This form of arboreal locomotion is typically used to travel from tree to tree. The species rarely descends to the ground. Thylacoleonidae is a family of extinct meat-eating marsupials from Australia, referred to as marsupial lions. Microleo is the smallest known and might be the basa most. While considered a powerful hunter, and a fierce predator, many today would assert that due to its physiology Thylacoleo was in fact a slow runner, limiting its ability to chase prey. Wokalio is hypothesized to have been an omnivore, eating significant amounts of meat, 
perhaps more like a bear in diet and habit than like an actual lion. Diprotodon was the largest marsupial that ever lived and it coexisted with the earliest human settlers of Australia. It may have been the inspiration for the Booniip in the Aboriginal mythology. It went extinct because of an extreme drought. Zygomitaris had a heavy body and thick legs and is believed to be similar to the modern pygmy hippopotamus in both size and build. The skull of Palorchists is formed so that it could have supported a short trunk. This similarity in nose shape is an example of convergent evolution with the modern tapers. Wombats have an extraordinarily slow metabolism, taking around 8 to 14 days to complete digestion, which aids their survival in arid conditions. Their primary defense is their tough and rear hide, with most of the posterior made of cartilage. During the Pliocene and Pleistocene, when Australia experienced changes in climate and vegetation, koala species grew larger. Modern koala may have emerged as a dwarf form of the giant koala. The reduction in the size of large mammals has been seen as a common phenomenon worldwide during the late Pleistocene. Nambaru is a basal quadrupedal kangaroo. A caldadita may have been a carnivorous kangaroo, based on their chewing teeth. A few specimens actually did also have long predatory fangs. The iris was a large kangaroo, similar to the better known Procoptodon. This two genius had a short face and probably lived off of a diet of plants. Procoptodon was unable to hop as a mode of transportation, and would have been unable to accelerate sufficiently due to their mass. Kangaroos living in dry, arid environments have been shown to exhibit higher densities of tooth enamel, caused by indirect hydration through consuming herb enriched plants. Kangaroos are the only large animals that hop as a primary means of locomotion. They live in a mob and groom each other and protect each other from danger. southern marsupial mole is extremely adapted to a burrowing way of life. It has large, shovel-like forepaws and silky fur, which helps it move easily. Also lacks complete eyes as it is little need for them. Although Tasmanian tigers looked like dogs, they didn't walk or run like modern canines. They nervously hopped on their two hind legs and eyewitnesses attest that they moved stiffly at high speeds. The last Tasmanian tiger died in captivity in 1936, but it may yet be possible to de-extinct the breed by recovering some fragments of its DNA. Its closest living relative is the numbat. It's a squirrel-like insectivore with powerful claws. It synchronizes its day with termite activity, which is temperature dependent. The Tasmanian Devil is a nocturnal and crepuscular hunter, spending the days in dense bush or in a hole. It has been speculated that nocturnalism may have been adopted to avoid predation by eagles and humans.